Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling an important question for developers using Jenkins and Git. Our viewer wants to know if it's possible to trigger a Jenkins pipeline when a tag is pushed to a Git repository, specifically on a private GitLab server. This is a crucial aspect for teams looking to automate their release and deployment processes based on project milestones. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll go through your question, go through the answers for it, and hopefully that brings you to your solution. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy to get to that solution just like me. And let's get started. To trigger a Jenkins pipeline when a Git tag is pushed, we first need to configure our GitLab repository to send a webhook to Jenkins. In the webhook settings, enter your Jenkins URL followed by slash GitLab slash notify commit. This will allow GitLab to notify Jenkins when a tag is pushed. Next, we need to ensure that Jenkins is set up to handle the webhook. This requires the GitLab plugin to be installed in Jenkins. Now let's configure the Jenkins pipeline. In your Jenkins file, you can define a trigger for the pipeline to run on tag pushes. Finally, test your setup by pushing a tag to your GitLab repository. If everything is configured correctly, Jenkins will trigger the pipeline automatically. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. Currently, Jenkins lacks a direct way to trigger pipelines on Git tags. You can check the related issue on their site. Alternatively, consider using release branches instead of tags. For example, if you name your branches starting with release, you can easily manage them in your pipeline. To extract the version number from a release branch name, you can create a variable that drops the release prefix. Keep in mind that these methods may require whitelisting to function properly. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To trigger a Jenkins pipeline on a Git tag, first, mark your pipeline job as parameterized and add a parameter for the tag. In your pipeline script, check out the tag if it's present. Next, Create a freestyle job that runs a script to check out the repository, get the latest tag using git describe, and compare it against a list of previous builds. If the build for the tag hasn't occurred yet, trigger the pipeline job remotely by passing the tag as a parameter. Make sure to update your list of builds to avoid duplicate triggers. Finally, set this freestyle job to run frequently to ensure it checks for new tags regularly. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer.
to trigger a Jenkins pipeline on a Git tag, use the multi-branch pipeline feature. Make sure to enable the Discover Tags option and consider using Spencer's solution for additional functionality. And that's it. I hope it's helped find you to that resolution that you're looking for. And if it did, please just take a moment, go down, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. Now, until the next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.